Hello, absolutely nobody. It's Fat Wap here. And I thought I'd do something a bit different on the channel today. This is a game I've played a lot off my channel, but it's um, Seven Days to Die. I'm playing it on the PlayStation 4 at the moment, and I thought I would show everybody my Day 49 horde. So this is my horde house. Um, I've set it up a little bit away from where I actually um, have all my other equipment and as you can see from my inventory I'm not really carrying much because I'm just about to to stack up for the night for the horde to come and attack but um, as you can see they've attacked this place quite a lot over the last few seven, seven day hordes I've blocked off this area here I've reinforced the floors, I've made these, I've knocked down the steps so they can't actually get up and I've reinforced the floor. Um, basically I kind of stand here, um, sometimes they knock down that wall there so I'll just shoot them and attack them there. Sometimes they come through here, they'll generally attack the door first and come into the door. So I'm pretty safe standing up here, but if they do get up, I can shut the door. And I've reinforced the floor here so they can't come up through there. The um, the left hand side over there is um, reinforced as well so they can't come up through there. And if they do get into this area, close the door up the steps. Um, and I've got another little area here, which is just a kind of basic area. I've, I've reinforced the wall around the door, close the door so I can actually. Um, hover on this ladder which I've taken the bottom step up so they should be able to get up here and then I've got a final safety room which is in here so it's fully reinforced steel or iron sorry um, got a fire it's got all the implements required to um, to cook or make tallow or grill or whatever and just got a basic drop box here which gives me space to drop things that I need for the horde night because this is just this is the only this is the only reason I have this is just to come and hide from the horde. Um, and to stop the spider zombies from crawling up I've built this which is this here was already there, it was like an awning and then I've just added to the awning to go around just in basic wood. Upgraded once. I upgraded it by accident into iron a few times. But this actually stops the spider zombies from crawling up onto the roof and attacking you from above. Um, I didn't have that on the first or second seven nights, and um, the spider the spider zombies actually got up and attacked me from above, which wasn't very really good. But um, I'll just collect the scrap while I'm waiting for the horde. I think I'm currently building a separate base in the middle of nowhere, which is going to be my main base. Oops, I thought that was my pick. It looks like my pick, but it's not. There's my pick there. Let's swap that over. Anyway, I was saying I was I'm making a base for what? Um, in the middle of nowhere next to a lake, so I need as much scrap as possible. So that's my plan for after tonight. I'm going to abandon this place, ship as much stuff across to my new location as possible, and start building that ready for the next seven day horde. I've been making concrete, cement, loads of iron, loads of steel and I'm going to properly reinforce the whole thing I won't take that because that will possibly loosen that up anyway, 21 to 82 um, just start preparing I think yeah so that's obviously what my horde building where I am now if you scroll up a little bit to this location here this is my main base where I've got my bed and all of my equipment to uh, to build and such and then as you can see I've unlocked quite a lot of the map because I was basically searching for iron for uh, sorry lead for so long um, but then if you scroll down here that's where I'm going to build my new location right next to water pretty central close enough to a town and far enough away from the road um, so that's where I'm going to be anyway. So I'm going to, from there, I'm going to head south tomorrow to the derelict area and just do an iron run because I need plenty more iron to, um, to upgrade the building before the next seven days hoard. 
uh, and I will eventually ship everything from my other location across. Um, but that's where I'm going to hit tomorrow, I think. But for the time being, I just need to do a bit of defending, just to get rid of this Horde Knight out of the way. And here it goes. Let's have a look where they're coming from. So, oh, come on, get up. They won't be able to go over that wall, so they'll just have to attack the bottom. Here they all come already. He doesn't like the post box. I don't know why. It's actually, if you sit up here all night, you can pretty much hide, because they won't knock down the building, they won't get up. Uh, and you can hardly even hear them, but let's go down and see. Through my doors, so you know, if they do get up, I can retreat to each level. But anyway, here we go. Horde Knights. I should be able to see through the holes in the wall to get them. There's a super zombie. Got another face shot. They take a lot of killing. So I've got a pistol, it's only got about 15 bullets in it. And I've got an AK which is half dead, so I expect that to die throughout the night. But I'm hoping a few police come to the door so I can pick up their bullets and whatever weapons they have on there. There's one there. So if they get in the door, I should be able to take them out. The only two the only two zombies that can get out are the dogs or the ones that crawl. Everyone else seems to have struggle. So as you can see I can just stand here, shoot these guys. But as you can see these guys take some killing. And I'm on the PlayStation 4 so it's uh, not the easiest to control. I might have to adjust the sensitivity at some point. But I've got 90 more bullets. There's a cop. Take him down. Okay, he's down. I might be able to loot his body if he's go away. Take him down. There's two cops. I don't know if I'll be able to get to the far away one. But I certainly can get that one once this guy's down. Oh, the other one just got him. Right, get him down. I'm trying to be conservative with my bullets because I realise I do not have that many. Let's right, see if I can get him crouch. Yep, yeah, there you go. A few bullets and a pistol. Oh, I am exposed here, so I need to get back up. There you go. Should be quite safe out. Yeah. I really want to get to that, but I'm stuck. I'm stuck, I'm stuck. Okay. He might have to just go get a boat. So the super zombie there. I wonder what's making me stick here. Just the sheer amount of bodies maybe. Okay, take this guys out. Keep going. Keep shooting. Take her. Well, the unfortunate thing with the PlayStation 4 version of this game is that if the bodies turn into mush, like they are there, you can't loot them. So it basically means the police copper who has just turned to mush is gone and all its equipment that he was carrying is gone. And basically by the time the end of the night comes, all of those bodies there will be mush as well so I won't be able to loot them, which is a bit of a shame. But uh, I don't think it's worth the risk jumping down and dying for a bit of whatever loot I've got. Generally, the guys are the only people that are worth looting anyway. They only carry bullets and weapons. Just a bit of reloading. I've only got 10 bullets left in the pistol. Not so many left in the AK, but my AK's never gone as well. 
it's only got two or three clips worth of and getting got just getting two bits of bullets. As I say, it seems to be the only zombies that can actually climb up here with the dogs or the crawly ones. That's my pistol down. I'll heal up. Well it's my pistol, it's getting close with that thing. Should be able to headshot some of these people. Zombies, I should say. But as, as you can see, it's not, you know, Horde 49. It's um, not that stressful if you properly set yourself up. I mean, I could have got myself, I've got a crate full of weapons in my other location. Um, a few more bullets, so I probably could have been more prepared. Got my SMG and a shotgun. Or got my pistol with a bit more bullets. But for what we're facing here, it's not... It's not so bad. The fact that you literally can't get in the door anymore because of all the, the dead bodies around. And the fact that if they did get in the door they wouldn't be able to jump up these, these steps I've made. We're pretty safe. So I just need to... Oh, headshot. Just need to survive the night. Oh, something's getting... Oh, hello. There we go. I'm going to I'm stunned as well. Get up. Shoot that. There comes another police. Yeah, let's go. Yeah. He's down. Crouch. Yep. Yeah. Okay. Sandwich, not donuts. Oh, headshot. Down. So I've got it on the short. I've got it on the shortest nights. So it's a hard night only lasts until. Oh, there goes one more blocks. Yes, yeah, so a whole night alone, yes, look for AM. Damn it. Two police there. We haven't been doing much splitting actually, which is good. But as I say, here he goes. That really does a lot of damage. Probably only got about 30 more shots out of the AK as well. Yeah. Will I get this clip and pick up before it fails? Will I get him? Can I get him? Come on, Luton. There we go. That's good. Pistol and some bullets from that. Let's buy it. There we go. Now, I probably won't repair any of this. Because I hopefully won't need to come back. Ah, oh, there's a super zombie. Let's get back out. If I'm lucky, I'm going to get 10 shots out of that AK. My crossbow's half done as well. I think I prepared very well for this. Headshot him. Keep going. Oh, there you go. AK's gone. Ten more bullets and the pistol. She's dead. And I'm out of bullets. Just do not blow up in here. Okay, missed. Go on. Oh, is he down? Oh, perfect. That's in the air. Oh, he gave me a lot of good stuff. He gave me a shotgun as well. If any of these get in, I might use the shotgun on them. I'll just keep plodding along here. It's um, one of the minute thirty left of Horde. Doesn't 
looked like we were going to get too many some more zombies left either, so. Oh, he's going to come up. I thought so. Let's axe him down. <coughs> Excuse me. That's the problem with this, they glitch onto each other and then you can get up a couple of the steps but they shouldn't get any higher than this. Just keep axing them. Jump up in a second. Load my shotgun. I picked up a fat police. Oh, he's right up now. Let's get back. These take so much beating, it's ridiculous. Let's get up here. Where's that shotgun? There we go. Don't need my wrench. Twelve. Plus eight. Oh, excellent. Should be able to take these two out. Still alive, he's gone. That was ridiculous. That was at least ten. Okay, reload this. Last seven bullets. What am I doing up here? Okay. Two more super zombies. That's marvellous. And that's that weapon gone. Okay, back up here. The AK doesn't work, got no more bullets. Looks like it's just a crossbow from now on. It's a bit ridiculous. This is going to take forever. 20 more seconds until Horde Knight's finished anyway, so I'm not too worried. Let's hit some of these guys with the axe. Here comes the dog. Brilliant. He'll jump up. Get rid of some of these bodies so I can move properly. Just gonna spend the next what, three minutes axing these guys. I don't care what kind of zombie you are, if I axe you in the head, you're dead. Yeah, I've only hit you at least 20 times, that's ridiculous. There you go. So the horde night is over, they'll start to walk now. Probably go outside and take these guys out and get them. These guys have a lot of health. It's not getting me though. Keep hitting. Ridiculous. I just hope there's no more of these guys out here. They are ridiculous to take out. Especially if you miss like that. There you go. Alright, let's have a look see what's outside. Oh my god, that. Off you go. Oh, I love that as well. Oh, there's a dog, really. Okay. Here's a Mr. Crispy. Oh, I missed. <laughs> Axe him. He's gone. Nothing on you. I forgot. In the corner. Oh, another super. Looks like there's a spider zombie in there as well. Bear with me. It's going to take another 20 hits to get this guy down. Oh, ooh, 
something got me good there. I need to heal back up. Come on, come on. Back to my oh, crossbow. Oh dear. That's a big rock there. Ah, and another hit. So hard to do this on the PlayStation. Keep hitting. It's an hour past the horde, and I'm still fighting them. I should have brought more weapons. Oh my god. Bleeding again. Another health pack, please. Yes, come on. Oh, and the spiders. Oh, I've decreased as well. The spiders out of this hole. Oh, I've trapped on a tree. Oh, ridiculous. Come on. All I want to do is just finish this horde, mate. And crack on with building my other house. But oh, he's gone. Again. Oh, okay. Horde ninety forty nine complete. Let's have a look. See what he's got. Ugh, nothing. Get rid of the rotten flesh. Don't want the bone. Everything else can stay. And there you go. As you can see, they've done a lot of damage, but they couldn't. They couldn't climb up. They broke it to here a little bit. Oh, there's another one. Take him down. A few more hits, you'll be done. Come on. Perfect. Horde Knight 49 done. They've done a bit of damage. I would probably normally spend the rest of today cleaning this up and fixing it to a quite a good standard for the next Horde Knight but because I don't really plan to spend another Horde Knight here if I have to I'll just leave it as it is because it is good enough to um, fend off a Horde anyway if I need to come back so I'll just go back up do a bit of inventory management um, and I'll probably come back and show you guys another one if anyone's interested anyway see ya